The entertainment world mourning the death of actor Paul Sorvino. His long career in movies, television and Broadway spanning more than 50 years. The critically acclaimed performer who played a mob boss in Goodfellas died of natural causes. He was 83. His daughter, actress Mira Sorvino, today tweeting he was the most wonderful father. Entertainment guru George Pinocchio is live at home with a look back at Sorvino's life and show business. George? Okay, hi, Ellen, Mark. In his many tough guy roles, Paul Sorvino knew how to give a powerful look that said danger and evoked fear. But that all went away when he smiled and he laughed. And that's the Paul I remember from events, from red carpets, and from interviews. But for many others, they will remember him best as Big Paulie from the classic gangster film, Goodfellas. You gotta watch out for him. He's a good earner. But he's wild, takes too many chances. No, I know that, I know Jimmy. You think I would take chances like Jimmy? And Tommy is a good kid too, but he's crazy. Paul Sorvino's role as mob boss Big Pauly in the 1990 movie Goodfellas became his most famous work. He'd already been working on the stage for a few years when he made his movie debut in the 1970 comedy, Where's Papa? Can't you see I'm serving luncheon? The following year, he would have a role in The Panic in Needle Park, the Al Pacino drama about heroin addicts. He would work with Pacino again as a police captain in 1980's Cruising, a drama about a serial killer murdering gay men, with Pacino going undercover to catch the killer. No gun, no shield. You get paid once a month, you get a telephone call telling you where to pick up the money, you report only to me. Another high point to his career, that championship season. Life is a game, and I am proud to say that I have played it with the best. He played a wealthy entrepreneur in the 1982 film, the same role that got him a Tony nomination for the Broadway play a decade earlier. Servino was a versatile actor who was also part of the cast of the 1991 action-adventure family film, The Rocketeer. Come on, kid, hand it over so we could all go home. On television, he was part of the original Law & Order. They don't sell hot guns at Brooks Brothers. And recently, he was back in a crime family, this time on TV's The Godfather of Harlem. Good luck with it, yeah? He played a man known as the Prime Minister of the Underworld, crime boss Frank Costello. Off camera, Sorvino liked to write and sculpt. And as I found out emceeing an event in Hollywood a few years back, he also liked to sing opera. <laughs> And he also loved to cook with his wife, Dee Dee. Among Paul's other credits, A Touch of Class, The Day of the Dolphin, and Reds. Live from home, George Pinocchio, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Yeah, what a loss. Great actor. George, thank you very much.